As RuPaul says, you're born naked and the rest is drag. Creep while you and me repeat this bittersweet heat is suffocating. I'm waiting and always hesitating. Kryptonite desires set my heart afire. everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel or if you're new hello welcome I'm Jack but when I'm in drag I go by Luna Rose because I'm the flower that blooms at night and the day that I'm uploading this tutorial April 23rd is in fact my birthday so I thought it was only fitting to do a full-on like birthday suit kind of nudish bronzy kind of transformation so I'm um, this is a look that I came up with. I really hope you guys enjoy this transformation. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below any other videos you want to see from me. And don't forget to subscribe to a bitch and hit that notification bell to tell you when I upload. There still should be three other transformations coming this week. So Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, a new transformation. So um, let's get on with this one. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your continued support. And um, let's transform, shall we? So I'm going to be starting this look off with a hefty amount of body bronzer and body highlighter on since girl I want this look to be glowy. For my face I first primed using my Smashbox primerizer and then for my base is pretty much all the same products that I always use. I will leave my full coverage highlight and contour routine in the description box down below but for my like secondary foundation I went in with my Dior Air Flash just because I wanted my skin to look extra dewy, extra luminous and extra golden. For highlight I used the Ivory TV Paint Stick from Kryolan and then I topped it with a little bit of my 070 white shade just to kind of further define my features and emphasize them more. For bronzer I went in with 10W in the Kryolan TV Paint Sticks and I applied a hefty amount of this since I want this look to be overall a very bronzed and goddessy and to be fair the eyes are really simple in this look so I'm um, mainly skin based look. For my base I just set it all down with banana powder and then I use my Coty Loose Air Spun Powder under my eyes just for that kind of a brightening highlight effect. I then just quickly filled in my brows off camera while the powder was baking to my skin and then for my eyes I basically just took the kind of warm toned row in the James Charles Artistry palette and just buffed them all over my crease. This look isn't really precise it's just a kind of bronzy smoky eyes so I'm um, Pack that shit on, girl, and blend it out towards your temples and kind of brow and deepen it as you get lower down in the crease of the eye. I also patted kind of the deepest brown shade all over my lid since I just wanted this look to be nice and smoky. I then did swap to the Dare to Create palette just for a deeper brown, just for that extra bit of definition, and then also smoked those same colours along my lower lash line. Once I was happy with kind of how it all looked, I quickly threw on some winged liner, popped some gold glitter on the inner corner of my eye, as well as my lower lash line kind of inner corner region since I just love how that looks. It just adds like a pop of glitter and sparkle and just adds a little bit more drama to the look. And that is the eyes are pretty much done. For my face, I just contoured and bronzed using my Makeup Revolution Highlight and Contour Kit as always. And then you guys know I love blush, so I'm um, heavily packed it on like usual. For highlight, I went in with Colourpop's Flexitarian Highlighter and literally just put that all over my face, all over my chest, all over my arms, everywhere since I wanted this look to be super glowy. For lips, I took Flesh Pot from MAC and then topped it with the MAC Myth Lip Glass since I wanted like a super nude but like super glossy kind of lip, so it's the combo that I live for. And then yeah, that is the finished look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this transformation and thanks for watching. While you and me repeat This bittersweet heat is suffocating I'm waiting and always hesitating 